Hey everybody, welcome back to Oprah Cat playing Paper Mario. So I'm in Shy Guy's toy box still. Wait, wait, don't leave me. Please let me out, mister. Okay? Apparently you got a talking lantern here. Hi, mister. I'm what? Can you, um, get me out of here? And just smack it. Yay, I got out. Yay for me. Thanks, mister. Hey, aren't you, um, Mario? You just saved me like a hero. You're a hero, aren't you? You're the coolest. You saved me from the mean guy who laughed like wee hee hee. I gotta make it up to you. I'll go with you, Mario, okay? I heard the, um, shy guy is saying that you're trying to save Princess Peach from Bowser. You're super great. You're the greatest great guy. I think you're the best. You I am such a suck up to you. So, um, I really want to help. I'll be good, really. I have a new party member. What joined your party? Press down to have her illuminate the area around you. With her light, you can see invisible blocks too. While in battle, she can shock enemies with Electro Dash or paralyze them with Power Shock. Ooh, it's pretty dark, huh? I, I, I kind of like the dark. But, um, now I can show you how helpful I can be, okay? Use my power, okay? So, I can actually still see a little bit on here, but I'm gonna do that. Wow, pretty cool, huh? Look, it's so bright now, tee hee hee. I bet nobody else can help like that, huh? Can they? Nope, now, let's go. <laughs> I'm not a voice actor, I'm sorry. This is the best I can do. <laughs> so here's a hidden block. But it's a snowman doll. That's great, I guess. So, since we just got a new partner member, we can go up here and actually, uh, get the, uh, what's, whatever it's called over here. The super block. Upgrade your party members. Uh, Watt is the only person left because I literally just got them. Do you want to upgrade this member? Hell yeah. Hell yeah, I do. <laughs> Well, has been upgraded super rank. I just met you like a minute ago and you're already super upgraded. So yeah, there's that. I guess I needed to fall this way. My bad. That's my own fault for not paying attention to what I should have been doing. Shit. Well, I went around the, the long way. My bad. <laughs> I'm not good at this game. I never claimed to be either, so we got that going. Oh, whatever. There's another hidden block here. What's in here? A vulture room. I can't carry it, though. Um... Let me toss this real quick. No! I'm gonna eat the mistake real quick, real fast. And then grab it again. I'll try and actually use the uh, snowman doll in battle if I can. Here we go, healing up here. So let's see what's down this way, then. Looks like something I gotta use Bombette for. No hidden blocks. Did 
They make really, really strange sounds. Ah! No! I'm gonna forego that item up there because I can't hold it. Oh, hi. So I guess I can use the snowman doll I just got, and since uh, there's a fire guy here, it'll be interesting to see how it reacts to something like this. It actually does more damage to the fire guy, even though I probably couldn't see it very well. Yeah, I haven't shown off Power Bomb either. It destroys all enemies on the ground. So let's try using that. Press it. Press A repeatedly. That's pretty good. And then up here, try and kill this guy in one fell swoop. I have not yet shown Watt off in battle, but we're about to see her anyway, so we'll do that in just a second. Very likely. And a sleepy sheep. Okay. This place is very weird. Run! Run for it! Run, Forest, run! I used that joke in the last chapter. Oh well. So, you came, did you? I am General Guy. We're following the orders of King Bowser by guarding a star spirit. Thanks for telling me your plans, and also this is the boss. As long as we keep it secure, we have permission to do whatever we want to here. I don't care for you, sir. You are rude, and furthermore, you're trespassing in here. Our toy box is off limits to the likes of you. The treasures inside this box are for shy guys only. And that star spirit's fate is none of your business. Prepare to fight me, sir. Taste defeat. Charge! I don't know, I'm making weird faces for the cat. So we have General Guy, the boss of Chapter 4. Okay guys, all together now, let's rush him. Charge! So I should probably, um... Let me try using the Vulture because I haven't even shown off what that does. You can electrify an enemy. I don't know how long it lasts, so I guess we'll find out. Um, this is what? Electro dash, penetrate defense power, and attack an enemy with electricity. And I totally screwed up the timing there. And that is how the Vulture Room is very useful. If there's enemies that actually try to make real contact with me, I'll just be like, no, screw that. If you try to touch me, you're gonna get hurt instead. Kill off more guys instantly. L let me try not to fail it this time. There we go, that's much better. We're gonna lose! Oh no, we gotta run! Wait, stand your ground, men. Now's no time for cowards. I will not abide deserters. You men make me sick. We must protect the toy box. Am I the only one with guts? Well, you're the general, so... <laughs> right over his own guy. Mario, you, sir, will pay. You beat my infantry. But that's all you'll do. Prepare for the next wave. So we got some shy guys on stilts. We haven't seen that yet. Go! Attack! Stilt guys! Fight, fight, fight! Yes, sir. Right away, sir. So, um... Yeah, I can't hammer them, but I can jump on them, probably. 
And that was terrible. And that only does four damage. And that also really hurt, didn't it? Blocked at that time. I'll take it. So even if I were successful in uh, doing the um, the action command with Mario's jump, I wouldn't have killed the shy guy right then and there anyway. Surprised the general guy is not attacking me himself. He's just hiding in his weird little machine. So far, all we've seen is the electro dash from Watt. Grr! Unbelievable! I guess it's time for my special battalion. We got them forming in all different ways. Ha 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 ha! I pity you, sir! It's time you paid, Mario! Attack! Yes, sir! So I think I'm gonna just gonna... What should I do? Jump, probably. Doesn't really seem to make a difference. So let's try Power Shock. If it works, paralyze an enemy with an electric shock. Turbo Charge. Electrically boost Mario's attack power for a short time. That would also be pretty useful, but we haven't seen this yet. Let's try this. Well, we got one stack of Shy Guys that's now paralyzed. Ow, that actually kind of hurt. Um, let's kill you right away. And we got one one tower of shy guys down. That's only gonna last so long though. Ooh, nice timing. I got the um, power hammer attack thing. Nine, holy crap, <laughs> that hurts. Got rid of that stack of shy guys too. Uh, good. Fine, I'll be you myself. Nobody embarrasses the brave shy guys of my army. Nobody. So he's gonna be like that. So I can jump on general guy or the bulb. If I try to jump on the general guy, doesn't hurt at all. And then if I land on this guy... So that will break through the defenses. My high-tech tank defenses don't seem to stand up to that electric attack. Quit doing that! It's, it's too powerful! You're breaking the rules of war! What rules? Ah, so the electric attack doesn't affect Watt because she's already electrified. So I suppose I could jump on the bulb? Take that out. Except the bulb doesn't seem to have... anything I can, uh... Sorry, I don't know what to say. I'm trying to figure out what to say. So... There's one simple way to remedy that. You Star Storm, it attacks all enemies, and guess what happens to the bulb when I try this? It's great, you'll love it. It just knocked the bulb off. That's so great. So how high is the defense then? Oh my god, I'm about to die already. Um, 10 HP, 10 FP. Did the Vulture wear off? I guess it did. That's not what I need, though. So... 
Yeah, bland meal, shroom cake, one of these two is ought to work just fine. So he's got 11 uh, things left. That still really hurt. Um, what about power jump? Can I damage him this way? Okay, I can damage him. I'm relatively sure that the general guy has two defense. So when I just tried to jump on him with a regular attack, it wouldn't hurt him. Ooh, I leveled up. Cool. What should I do? I don't really use FPL that much. HP has seemed to be doing okay. Um, I feel like I probably should go with either HP or BP, though. Yeah. BP sounds good. Let's just do that. <laughs> I'll do HP ne next time. Nice job, you tripped. But yeah, we beat the general guy. Yay! Yippee! We beat the shy guys! <laughs> you weren't so tough, you silly old shy guys. I beat him up, didn't I, Mario? You did a good job, what? I met you like 10 minutes ago and you're kicking ass already. Good on you. And we got the Sailor Star, or whatever. We Not much over here, but whatever, let's go. That's always nice. To save the fourth star spirit, Muscular, Mario, and team disbanded the gang of Shy Guys Tufts. Slowly, it seems as if the life force is returning to the once bleak night sky. But the stars won't truly shine until the star rod is rustled from Bowser's evil grasp. Three star spirits still await rescue. Where in the world are they being held? Save and continue. Yeah, sure. Okay. Ba, ba, da, ba, ba, ba. Hey, Twink! Those guards have stopped paying attention to us again. Let's sneak out of here. We might be able to find some news to help Mario. Do you think it's still safe to use that secret path? Don't you think Bowser's figured it out by now? No, because Bowser's stupid. It's still alright, Twink. Bowser hasn't noticed anything. How? How has he not noticed that? He looks scary, but he's basically a major bonehead. <laughs> Let's get out of here. Come on. So, press the button. Do the thing. I don't know how they haven't noticed this yet. Doesn't make a whole lot of sense to me. So we actually skipped going down the hallway this time around. And we got the special peach music, but then when we go out here, and it's dark and scary again. We went in here last time. I'm pretty sure that there's no point in going up here. Because they'll want us to actually explore around a bit more. So what about in here then? Uh, huh? Who are you? Oh, look, it's Peter Griffin again. Why, I'm Princess Peach, and who might you be? Oh, you're Princess Peach? Everyone calls me the Gourmet Guy for some reason. I wonder why. I guess I'd better report you to King Bowser. You aren't supposed to leave your room. But I am really hungry. Tell you what, I'll keep this a secret if you make me something really yummy. Ooh, bribery, my favorite. <laughs> so, Princess Peach, 
What do you say? Will you cook me something or what? I'd love to cook for you, Mr. Gourmet Guy, but I have no ingredients and no utensils. Aw, oh, that's no problem. There's a kitchen one floor below us. It's five star. Princess Peach, you live in this castle. You should know what you're supposed to be doing. You live here. You can go cook there. Here, you'll need this. This key will open a door that leads downstairs. Now you can get to the kitchen. Princess Peach lives in this castle. She should know where to go already. So yeah, there's still guards, whatever. Don't get caught. Don't be stupid. Okay. Castle key, going downstairs. And we went to the kitchen once before, if you remember that. Oh, don't get caught. Oh, that was super smooth, wasn't it? Also, these guards are pretty freaking blind to not notice this kind of stuff. Well, here's the kitchen. So, what shall we do first? Good question. Princess Peach. This looks like a good cookbook. Let's use it, okay? So, how's it look, Twink? Anything look really yummy? Hang on a second. Oh, how about this? Special strawberry cake. Sounds good. Let's whip one up. Okay, Twink. Read me the recipe. Well... Okay, please listen carefully. First, put sugar and eggs in a bowl. Go ahead, Princess Peach. When you're finished, let me know what... And we'll move on to the next step. There, there's no measuring amounts of anything. Look, I don't know how to cook very well. And even I know that you need measurements of stuff. Like how many eggs? How much sugar do you need to put in? Anyway, we're going to do all of this cooking in the next episode. So thank you all for watching. And I hope to see you next time.